Hi guys, this is Ali and welcome to Stuff Behind the Wheels. How are you guys doing today? I hope everybody great. I hope everybody had a great weekend. So, what to yesterday? I went to uh, I went to, you know, just like drive around a little road trip with my dog and sister. So, uh, so I found a park and we just like pulled over and take our dog to walk, you know, and like, you know, see what's what so anyway that was like a like you know like a forest state place like uh you know trees you know great place green you know crazy so anyway the, at the end of that day uh we just left went home and yeah so like i took a shower i and you just like sit, sit eat like some food you know and chilling you know have some tea or stuff anyway and then like I felt like here some like strange hurt like pain and no exp like I, I don't know why I didn't know what it is it was like 2 a.m. or so I first I thought it's just like a somber you know because it was like so hot at that Sunday Anyway, uh, so like I felt and touched it, I felt something. I took my shirt off. I immediately think it was like 2 a.m. And I'm gonna be honest with you, I was like a little high. Watching some movies, drinking some tea, you know. And then I immediately went to the uh, washroom and I knew something was off. I, at first, I thought it's a mole. I tried to take it off can't see it right I immediately went uh, to shower take up my shirt off and check it out fucking tick and there was a tick bite on me it was crazy I get, get this is the first time in my whole life that happened to me right so like I immediately woke my brother and he just came and take it with scissor that uh, tick Take it, he take it up and started to walk. We just like flush down the toilet. So here's the worst part. It started to hurt, and I get so paranoid. I didn't know what to do. I didn't want to call 911. We are in COVID situation. Everybody busy, and I don't want to, you know, waste their time. So anyway, uh, and we had a hospital like emergency really close my house so I told my siblings that I gotta go there gonna go check myself right so it was like 2 30 a.m. in the morning and I I just started to walk to the hospital it was just like three minutes walk right so I went to emergency room and it was like a horror movie horror movie one guy there like coughing sneezing like gagging and stuff the other guy was like you know uh, sleeping and snoring and there is one guy just sitting right middle of the, like there was like so many seats and there was just like one seat and the guy was just like sitting in there and uh, and went to security there is I'm saying hi 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 he doesn't give me any answer he doesn't even give, tell me hi right and then I see the other receptions. I went there and I, I tried to talk to him. I told him, he said, what you have? I said, take bite. He said, oh, okay, go, go, go to the register room. So I went to the register room and there was no nurse. So same security that he didn't answer. So I told him, hey, sir, and just like, you know, uh, I just like, with like hard work. I said, hey sir, I said, I, I, I need uh, uh, like help. He said, what happened? And I told him that like tick, tick bite. He didn't even care. He said, he said like, oh, okay. There is nobody, nobody to take your register right now. Just go sit there. It was like horrible. And I was sitting there, uh, open an internet and like looking what could happen or could not, you know. I was like super super paranoid and the, the, the place is totally empty and you can feel tension in the air it was crazy 
It was like 3 a.m. in the morning. I didn't know what to do. And I just said, you know what? It's not worth it. You know, okay, this is tick by, but I can't get COVID right now. Like I didn't want to. I, I didn't. I didn't want that. And and then just I just left. I just left the hospital. I didn't know what to do. I just went back home. And and I I couldn't sleep until like 6 a.m. Couldn't sleep. Get so paranoid. Like you know, itching. And here. There is, it still hurts. I don't know why, like it's hurting me. And usually the tick, bite, tick bites are not hurting, right? I, I, I don't know, I, I have no idea. Whatever I, I say, I'm say i saying is from the Google. I have no idea. I don't have no idea how it's work. I have no idea how, how it's done, I, I don't know. So I tried to call a uh, nurse. They told me that the nurse can talk to me after 14 hours. I said, all right, there's nothing we can do. I need to talk to nurse. I don't know what to do. And I am just like, you know, uh, I don't know. I'm just panicking anyway. And then what happened was I finally slept, woke up, you know, brushed my teeth and and then uh, I was, my sister called me and she was like, well, she was like worried what happened, how I feel and stuff. And then while, while we were talking, she just said, oh yeah, let, let's do FaceTime me. And at the same time, I'm telling her, no, 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 no. Then, then the nurse called. I couldn't get the answer and I couldn't keep in touch with her. And then, I called them back. They said, oh, they're gonna call me two times more. And no one did call me. And now it's like 24 hours now. And didn't get any call. I don't know what to do. If anybody had that situation, please comment. I know I don't have that much views, but like maybe, maybe someone gonna see that and knows about the ticks. Please call me, like text me or whatever. I mean, comment please because I am freaking out I don't know what to do and I didn't even gonna take the video I didn't even have a GoPro my my friend uh, got it got it back mm, when I do that it's hurting me hold on the hurting here or here I don't know anyway so I went to get my uh, I want to get the GoPro and that's why I'm just recording at night right now because I already done work, working. So gonna go home, and I didn't wanna because I wanted to. As I say, I gonna apply every day, right? And I, 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 I didn't wanted to take a video. So yeah, so I went him. Guys, please be careful. If you guys going to like forest kind of stuff, like a small, you know, trees and places like a park please be careful there is ticks I don't know I might even get the Lyme disease I don't know I don't know what's gonna happen right now I am super worried really really worried I don't know what to do I gotta call the nurse again I need to talk some medical advisor I mean, I, I I don't I need even get tested. I guess. I'm sorry, guys. I I wanted to talk about something more interesting. That but like this is what happened to me, and it's weird. And uh, this has never happened to me. I swear. Look, and I am. I'm not. I'm not stranger forests or mountains and stuff. I mean, I even learned how to swim in the river. It was like. When I was a kid, you know, and uh, I have always been around like stuff. I have never bitten by any ticks or snakes or shit. I don't know, nothing. And this is first time and I don't know what to do. If you guys have any advice, please comment, tell me. And now I'm just gonna go home, have my dinner, it's already late. 
let's see what's gonna happen. I am paranoid right now. I, I couldn't even sleep. I always like constantly like each myself. I I don't know what's gonna happen. Anyway, I guess this is the end of my video, and I will be updating you tomorrow. And it's actually nice to take a video today. I feel you know I feel better. Talk to you guys and yeah. I hope everybody have a great day and yeah love each other care for each other forgive each other and stay safe I will see you tomorrow